What's up Elite Thin X Athletes? I'm John Oslager and today we're gonna to be doing a workout to build a wider back. All right, let's get started. The exercises that we're gonna be performing are gonna engage all of the muscles in our back. However, we're gonna be incorporating techniques such as the front lever, which is gonna emphasize on our lats, resulting in a broader, fuller back. In today's workout, we have seven exercises. A few of those exercises are pretty advanced, but I'll be sharing some easier progressions that are gonna target the same muscles, allowing you to do this workout no matter what fitness level you are. With that being said, let's get into the first exercise, which is gonna be muscle ups. Let's go for 10. There, we have muscle ups. We're gonna go over to this bar and I'll show you guys an alternative to muscle ups, which is the negative muscle up. This is what it should look like. exercise you really want to focus on controlling that dissension and going down as slow as possible. Doing so you're going to be engaging the same muscles that you would in a regular muscle up. Next up we have wide pull ups. Let's go for 15. There, we have wide pull-ups. If you're not able to perform those yet, we have another progression called wide Australian pull-ups, which is performed on a lower bar. This is what it looks like. Get that wide grip, bring your legs in front of you. You want your body to be completely straight, and then you pull to your chest. allows you to reduce your body weight but still engage the same muscles as you would in a pull-up. We're gonna go back to the pull-up bar. Next up we have front lever raises. This exercise really emphasizes on our lats which is really gonna help build a wider back. Let's go for 10. There we have front lever raises. If you're not able to perform this exercise with your legs extended, you can do it tucked. Let me show you what that looks like. Bring your knees to your chest and go up. is to make your back parallel with the ground. Next up, we have lat pull downs. This is a pretty similar exercise to the front lever raises. However, this is more of a dynamic movement, emphasizing more on our lats and less on our supporting muscles, such as our core. Let's go for 15. There, we have lat pull downs. It's very similar to the lat pull downs that you would do on a machine. You really wanna focus on keeping your arms completely locked out 
as well as your body completely aligned, pushing down, emphasizing mainly on your lats, like I said before. When you first start performing this exercise, you might not get the height that you intend to get at first, but over time, as you develop strength and get more comfortable with using your momentum, you get more range of motion to help build those lats. Next up, we have inverted row pull-ups. We're gonna go for 10. So as you guys can tell, that's a pretty advanced movement, but I got an alternative for you guys, which is gonna be elevated Australian pull-ups. But instead of pulling to our chest, we're gonna be pulling to our waistline. Let me show you what that looks like. When doing those, you really want to focus on keeping your body parallel with the ground. Next up, we have pull up hold for 20 seconds. Let's do it. There we have the pull up hold. So during the exercise, you wanna make sure to have a really strong grip. And if you're not able to hold it for 20 seconds straight, just break it up into four rounds, hold for five seconds, or even longer if you can. But if you're not able to do the pull up hold yet, we have an alternative, which is the Australian pull up hold. Let me show you what that looks like. You wanna get in the regular Australian pull up position, pull to the top, squeeze your grip, and hold it for as long as you can. Over time, after doing this and incorporating other exercises, you're gonna increase your strength to be able to do these exercises on the pull-up bar. Next up, we have Australian pull-ups. We're gonna do this for high reps. We're gonna go for 25. Let's do it. That completes round one. We have three more rounds to go to complete today's back workout. If you're having trouble completing any of the exercises, make sure that you're incorporating the alternative progressions that I showed you to make sure you're maximizing your results. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to smash that like button and share this video with a friend that's looking to get a wider back. Comment below what you guys wanna see on the next video and comment within the first 30 minutes of this upload for a chance to win some free Thenx gear. And for more workouts just like this, sign up at thenx.com and become a member for full access to our daily workouts, technique guides, and workout programs. And download the Thenx app to take our workouts with you anywhere. Join the millions of Thenx athletes around the world getting in the best shape of their life. Thanks again for watching. We post every Sunday at 8 p.m. USA Eastern Time. I'm John Oslager. Till next time.